We thank God for his salvation. Today is the most important day on the Christian calendar. Yes. The Resurrection Sunday. Amen. The day that my Lord proved to all demons that they are nothing. Amen. They can't do anything to him. Amen. He laid down his life and he arose from death victoriously. Hallelujah. Amen. So I greet you all today around the world. In Jesus name. Amen. I'm still talking about the ability to see. Ye danyamia se e won in kwaji ya hum. E ne ye da ponda ke siye pa e di ma e jidi fo. E san se ne dey e ne ye kaye radi yesu kristo nkunim diya o di wo adamo ni so. O chila adamo ni se o nye shi e won enim. O do nwan in kwatu ho. And no sound sorry one couldn't be able. Hallelujah. Amen. And the Niji Dakasia Pa. And until we are here for Naina, we cheer more, yes, so demo. Amen. Me go so I cast a father a bit to me, a more huna dear ye a home. Let's hear the heavens report for today. People come and go, but I remain forever. Demons that you are afraid of are all under my power. I am the only one who can annul the plans and deeds of demons. I will burn them forever in the lake of fire that I have prepared for them. I remain forever. So it is me that you should revere and fear. Yes. That says the Lord. This is Pastor Dr. Kukudazi reporting live from heaven. Yenti ene heaven amani bono. Eni papa amani pako nanso metihoda adamonia usro womano wengine she mitume asi. Minkwa na metimi asei wansusu ye ene wane ye. Meshi wongwa ujatadie nwa mesiesi ama wanumu afibo. Midye meti asida. Enunti eye me ene sese usuro na udie nidye emame. Sedye erade esieni. We yo sofo Dr. Kuku Dazi, Mama Niboa, may the free heaven. As I was saying last week, demons want people to be stubborn to rebel against God's word. Said the enemy can now watch you to a bono. Adamo ni pese ni pa ye aswa din fo na o tia tia etia nyankopon asem. They don't want people to know anything about God's punishment for stubborn and rebellious people. One person nipa be hunu bi biya afa nyamia suchia o dima aswa din for ene etuatil for. When stubborn people are reminded that some people indulged in the same sin and were severely punished by God, they don't mind. They still continue in their sinful lifestyles because of demonic inducement. Say, Ubo etiatil for coco. Say, Enipe be a bonia, Womu yenuabi. Na yankupon chin was super na emu a dinner. And for one cra Ugusua etna won bonia bra bonua, wo bonuam, a sound damonia, a cowasunti. Demons harden their hearts and don't want them to take any cue from what God did to the people who indulged in the same sins as they are indulging in now. Adamoni a prim woman kuma na on pese obe siyan bi biye free di enyankupon di ye nipanoa omu ye bonenoa 
omoye no ebino demons don't want such people to fear god and his word they want people to fear them instead and do what they want and that is exactly what is going on in this world today adamo ni mpese enipa besro nyame ene nasem opese nipa esro wo mumom na wo ye de wope na sa pepe pepe nso ene ekose wo ene ewiase mu in the world that we live in now it's the wishes of demons that are being done not the will of god who created the universe and demons o wi ase mu a yeti sese mu e ye di adamo ni pe e na ni pa ye ne mom enye nyankopon a wo bo wi ase ina ani adamo ni no mom e pe it is because demons have induced many conscious politicians to do whatever they can to enact laws and make such laws override god's laws nina asichire ni se adamoni e ka amayo fo asika ani braji wo madwin so se omunye de ombetumi bi ahihye mra ebe twia fa nyankopon mra eso demons want to make god's laws unimportant and it's very sad eh very very sad and that is what is going on in our world today adamo ni pese o ma nyankopon asem eso man faso bia na e ya rehopa na sa pepe pepe nso ana ekose wo e wiya se ayi tigbe se se the law makers of nations are making it seem as if there is no god so human beings should follow their way of thinking their way of understanding the issues of life and how they want to live their lives emra chefwa o wa mana mamu e mana kame aye ti se de nyame biye ne ho anu ti eni pada se ni eni wo mu kwan a wo mu fa so wo mu de dwen wo mu enti ase a wo mu wo wo abrabo mu eni kwan a wo pese wo wo bo wo abrabo no achi the world is at a point where the wealthy nations and their political cohorts are the ones telling people about the moral values of life ewia si aba bedru ba bia amana mana wonya won ho no ene amayofo nso a wo fo a won so no ene ay ka che nipa e fa abrabo pa esese nipa ba the way they enact crooked immoral laws and want to force them on people is very very disturbing e kwen a omo pese omo fa so I di shemra fu pa ni obresu enko na um pese um di sheni pa ko no e ha dwen pa ai ask yourselves does god exist and does he have laws if god exists and he has moral laws for his creation is it right to throw away the laws of god who created you and enact laws that go against his word eh mo amu misa mo hwe anye bia nyame owo ana na owo nso a owo mra na se nyame wo ho na se wa she obra pa mra e dia ma na body a e ye se wo beto nyame obo wo no mra to atwene na wo ankasa wa she mra ekuti ana se mo ana eh Hey. Is it right to force people to accept a law that makes people rebellious against God and let them live perversely? Eh? E yesa wo be she ni pa se wonje mbra bia e be ma ni pa ate atua ate anyankopon sem na wa bo ahuhubra na. Is it right to adhere 
to the regulations of tenants and disregard the rules of the landlord? Eh? Eh, yes, eh? Ube di wamo hai dain wo fie nou en shi se yechi na wa tu e fie ou la amra agu anan. What today's politicians and lawmakers are doing is like staying in someone's house and making their own laws within. Die ene aman yo fo, ene mra she fo e yene te se, obi ti, obi fie, na o shi she o no an emra e o fie ho. Such tenants have forgotten that they live in someone's house. Nipa etisa o hina hina dino. Wore fise obifiena o mute. And if you live in someone's house, the rules you may set up as tenants come under the rules of the landlord. Nese muti obifia. Mo amo hina hina dino. Mre bia amo besheno. Eche efira no mra asi. The rules of the landlord overshadow the rules of tenants. Embra efiura besheno. Eche embra wamo hina dino. Eche no eso. Many of today's politicians and lawmakers have forgotten that. They live in God's earth. So the laws they enact in their countries are under God's laws. It is God's laws that are the most important. But the wealthy nations and their induced politicians want people to obey their crooked laws and pattern their lives after them. Ni pedi wamo mbra boni no achinchi ma bata nechi ne ni pa bo ma bra bo eti se wamo. They want people to throw away the laws of God, the Creator, and abide by the laws of human beings. O pesi ni pa tu niyami o ba di ni mbra ego na o be di ni pa da se ni mbra echi. Such rich people and their political cohorts have forgotten that they are only temporal tenants in the house of God, which is the earth. And it is God who owns the house. So it is his laws that are to be feared and obeyed. Yeah. Wamu ye nipa, wamu hen hai dain, e wo nyanku pon fiye e breti abi. Na e nyanku pon na e fiye di ene dia. Me patre asasi. E nunti e yonon nimbra. E ne sese ye suru pa na ye diso. Your national laws are only temporal. E mbra mo shishe shishe wo mo mana ma mono. E wo ho e breti abi pe. Because when the earth is destroyed, your national laws, which are human laws, will become useless. Sasasi saya, mama na ma embrano a e ni pa da seni embrano, mfaso biya masubeo. If you think that your country is now under your control, so you have power to enact laws that suit you, and you don't care. If such laws go against God's word, you are very funny and a child. Because it will come to a time when your country will be no more. Say a white jeans a woman shall answer. And unti uo to me, obi to me, dear Shemra, a boawa, Nessem possess Ambra no cra, Kutian, Kupan, Semnem, Fauwan. 
won esri pa na we ya bofra e san se e bre bi be ba o man no kra no na ndi ho bi o go to israel and ask about where sodom and gomorrah used to be and you understand what i'm telling you now ko israel na ko bisa be bia na sodom ni gomorrah no na wo na obeti de me ka che osesi anasi those five cities chose to endorse homosexuality to provoke god and god burnt those cities to ashes and they are no more san kronum no o yi se o mu de o be pere me ma ne me ma na so e de ahye nyame abufo na nyankopon hye san kronum ina se jirebe e ma na kansun na o ni ho bio Today, there is no city called Sodom, and there is no city called Gomorrah. Mm -hmm. They are all gone. And they, Krobia and who are friends Sodom, and a Krobia said who are a friend Gomorrah. Omo ina ni hobi. God proved to them that the earth and its fullness belong to Him, not those who allow men. To go with men in their cities. Nyankupon edane di chre wamo se. E viasi. E di mouni men yina. E yene dia. E nye sa aken di fwo nwa. Wamo pre su ma mema. E ni mema daye. E wo wamo kro nwa. E mouni. What I want the lawmakers of nations to comprehend is that. Your laws. O rap. Around God's laws, there may be say a man your for a woman a man who eti asie ni se umbra no e fa nyangu pon di ano. What I mean is that God's laws are the base. There may be say ni se nyangu pon umbra no e nuni ashasi umbra. Every other human law is a copy. Of God's laws. Ni pa da se ni mbre biya no. O mi suyen fri nyan kou pa mbre no. So if you disagree with God's laws. As if they are not important to you. Scrap God's laws. From your laws. And you will see that. You don't have any law. And you will see how chaotic. Your country will be. And you will say, Oh, you are the only one who is 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 the only He shouldn't be killed or shouldn't be imprisoned because you shall not kill is God's law. To Sam Ranwa, a ma, a woody for a year at the boy for no at to go. Nasu will be cum obia. When one cast in the Pacro do I bonnet, now one kunu announce out the nut to a fiasso and a watching us. A son says, Sam Rano, a young copombra. It is God who first said, Thou shalt not kill. E nyamine di ka ka se, Men kum obi. So if you don't agree with God, Scrap that law. E di sa o si o ni nyame nyajini ya, Tu sa amra de go. Scrap the law, That incriminates thieves and robbers, Because you shall not steal, is the law of God. To some brand on swa, a ma a yifoya di bon yifoya ni egu. E san se, me yuya di eno, e non susu ye nyanko pomra. Scrap pedri from your laws, because you shall not lie, is the law of God. Se ubi di atro, e wo asendi biya, Anaudia dansi krumu ewa hoa. Tusambra nigu. 
isan se menni atrono e nyankopomra if everyone should be allowed to love the way the person wants then scrap the law that incriminates rapists because that is also their way of love si enya ma obi ano kwan ofaso a opese ododi a eni embra no a ye se otumu na odi fo no tugu e san se ono so so kwan opese ofaso a odi do no stop taxing your people because the idea of taxation is from god's law of tithing it is god who tells his people to bring a tenth of their produce or income to his house men jiji to obiara in free timamufo nso so e san se to oje no e nyankopon adwen a o ka kire ne nkrofo se wo mu no baya obema omadua nyina na wo monya ana se wa hunya bi obenya no wo fa mu abupen edu emfa mra ne fie so if you don't agree with god don't use his laws in your countries and unti sa oni nya me nya dwen a mamu mfa ne mra enya dwuma e wo mama na man no and the homosexuality that you want to force on people don't use the word marriage go and find another word because marriage was brought about by god and the equation was and still is between male and female yeah. na fenso sa me mane me mana no a wo pese chinchira wo de she enipa kon no men kase e ya ware e san se asemfo a ye fere no aware ne de e ye nyankopon ne de bae na odi bae no so o se e ye bema ene o ba en si emu ene ye fere na ware so if you disagree with god don't use the word marriage and don't you say only nya me nya dwene a she ne wan kofa sa semfo ana anka se ma ware no if you believe in human rights then you are telling god that what human beings see right in their eyes is what should be done not his will oh. it's serious oh serious ask yourself is it god's will that should be done here on earth or human rights na bisa hu e e yankopon pe e ne sese e koso asasi so ana se de nipa da sene e hu no se ten wona ne so if what some people see as their right is what should be done then don't imprison any offender or anyone who flouts your laws because what such offenders do that you see as wrong in your eyes it's also right in their own yeah. eyes. Yes. Said ye, any part that say ni hunse etin wo no an any so necessary wo ye dia. Any obi a obetu umra no. When wo an hunu se wo ye boni, anase wo tumra. Isan se, die sa ni pano ye do an. Wo hunu se, e ye mfumso wo wo ni so no. Wo no so ni so na chere. Yeah. Therefore. If homosexuality goes against God's word and you see it as a human right and one's way of love, then don't imprison any man who makes love to an animal because that is right in his own eyes. Enunti se, e me mani me manano, e kutye nyanku pansem, na wo se, e ye nipa da se ni adi ebi obetu mi aye. E san se e ye kwan a opese ofa so dono no dia. E ni e when one fa be me biara oni abu abe ko akodan antum. E san se e no so so e tene wo no ankasa ni so. 
when someone steals, don't see it as a wrong and imprison him because the thief also sees it as right in his own eyes. So, be weird here. Men who say, a bonny and out in a cotton. A son said, Really, so who say, the oil, you know, a ten or no one can say If you say, when you imprison a gay person, he will go there and teach others in prison. So, it's not good to imprison them. Then, don't imprison a thief. Because he also go into prison and teach others about stealing. So who can say? And say say a di be me biara oni ni yonku be madatum. It's an say o ko efiasi o be ko akotre o mo hon mo muso a esai bi dia. Eni e me mfe risu so unko tu efiasi. It's an say o nusu ko ha o nusu be ko akotre unko fo ko a efasi uyadi. Allow everyone to love the way the person wants, because that is how he or she wants to love. Jaimo bia no kwen o pese o faso doso. E san se sanye ni pakron so so e pese o faso a o didon. When an adult chooses to rape a minor, don't imprison him. Because that is right in his eyes. He loves to sleep with minors. It is also his human right. Allow him to do that. Se penyini bi yi se Obe tuwa koda kiti kiti bi monanswa. Men fanu nko tuwe fiasi. Isan se wo ono suwe ni ase no. Etine manu. Ope se oni nko da nko da ne da. Enu ti jano. Na ono susu nye sa. When someone kills his fellow human being to use him as a sacrifice. It shouldn't be a crime. Because that is also right in his own eyes. He is using his fellow human being to make money. That is right in his eyes. So let him continue to do that. If that is your principle. So be kumu ni yonku nipa. E di koboa forye sun sumwa. E nsese. E ye mraton. E sanso. No susu e tine wo eniso eniso. O di se nipa nu peska. E tine ni e jano. No nye. E nsese e boni wo eniso. Se sane in shise ya o kandia. You see, according to my analysis, that money can let some people lose their senses of reasoning and don't see how partial and myopic they are. One will come here, si kabe tu mi ama nipa da se ni ashe na jen ya o di jen. Na ama o ye nipa, o ye nyi yi mouna, o chako a fan, na na jene mou no. I want you to understand that this world is not for human rights lawyers. Mi pese moti asiese e wi asi e ni wo sa e mrenim fu ono a o mo si ni pada se ni wo ho a utumi ye de open why? Na mo be chere yen de ye eni de enye. Human moral laws are given by God who created human beings not by human rights lawyers who don't know how human beings were created. Nyame, ene dia brabo pa mra, e man nipa, o boy yen. Nemo, e nye, e mre nimfwa, o mo se, nipa da seni, e betu mi aye di opa, o nim kwa ye fa soa, e bo nipa. When you stand before God, you will give answers, to all of these questions. So, who did not yanku pon ni mo? Who be ye san se me ni ano? Scrap all these laws from your national laws because they are from God. You don't like. To sambre ina gu e free mama na mai embrano emu e san se e free nyami a umpeno no eho. You see how short-sighted and ignorant you are for disregarding God's laws? One who say, we will be a uhuna dee ewe ni mwe ni muhe ya na we nye ubi a u nimi de sa u bunyan kupomra enimti ya one 
your forefathers and the monarchs of old were wiser than you because they referred to the Bible and copied God's laws for their countries because God's laws do not bring chaos in the society as you want it to be now. If all men should go with men, and if all women should go with women, don't you see that you want to stop reproduction? Hmm. Eh? Don't you see it? Yeah. Eh? And why do you want to stop reproduction? Yeah. Don't you see you are being induced by demons? Yeah. Eh? Why? Even animals are still producing. Yeah. So why do you want human beings to stop reproduction? If animals stop producing, where will you get meat to chew? And if human beings stop producing, where will you get a child to adopt? If plants stop producing, where will you get food to eat? Eh? So you see that that mindset of stopping reproduction is stupidity from the pit of hell. What who say? Why do you know? When you open, say we see a one to a to a saw and no coin. If you are men, don't go, don't go. I walk on some gem. You see how demons want to induce weak-minded and money-conscious politicians to destroy this world? Hmm. If you want to go against God's word and you ever drink water, breathe fresh air, and enjoy the sunshine, you curse yourself. Yes. Because they were created by God. I want all presidents and monarchs to comprehend that your national laws are human and temporal, but God's laws are divine. And abides forever. Hallelujah. Me pese a man penim for any a him for ina ti asye se mu ma imra no e ye nipa da se nimra e wo breti a wabi ne nyang kupon mra de e ye mra krun krun na abetra oda. It is God who created human beings and put them in His garden and gave them His laws. So every human law came to meet God's law. God's laws came first before every human law. Eye nyankopon ne bo enipa da sani na wodi won tena ne trum na wo ma won ne mra. Anu ti nipa da sani mra bia e betu nyankopon mra. Nya mra ne ba kane that is why most of the national laws are a copy of God's laws.
Therefore, if you are a lawmaker and you want to enact laws that go against God's law, you don't know anything. You don't know the history of this world and the repercussions of your actions. And until so you embrace me, next I hope so she embrace. A kuti e nyangu pa semwa unimshi unimviasi abakosem na namono a utu onsono unimhonsu saso. I'm telling you that no one can throw away God's law and succeed. Me catch now say obi antu min tu nyangu pa umbranchi na ni oye ni ye yida. If you challenge God, what will you do if he removes you from this earth? Mm-hmm. Eh? Say, open your mouth, you are you free as I see so I Eh? I want the judiciary, the legislature, and the executive in every nation to comprehend that you are temporary custodians of your lands. You don't own your lands. Mm-hmm. God Almighty is the owner. Me can't tell me a chef for, a me name for me a temwa for, a me man penim for. Owa manama mu ina mu se. Sha mu she o maino sono, a ye briti a bi. Na masasi no, a ni wamo, a ye nyame a na ene dia. It will come to a time that your country will be no more. And all your laws that you enacted will be useless. Embre bi beba mu maino kura ne ne hobi o. Ne mbra no amu shisha shisha ye ira ano. Enfaso bi amaso. As I said early on, you live in God's earth. So your laws are not important than his. Just as I gave you the analogy between the rules of tenants and the laws of the landlord. Said the medical canon, Muti nyan kupon asasiso, and unti mumrano, a hun yan chen yamediano. Said the medi, Womo hai dine, and she shaye, and a few ran so so embrano, a yan fatuhun. Don't behave as if. The temporal powers conferred on you by fellow human beings make you immortal. Men yaw who te said ye to me noa we yon kun ni pada seni en a dia mauno e mau ye ti said ni pada seni a wunguda. You will die one day and stand before God to give account about the laws you approved or disapproved. And if you went against God's word, you will regret doing so. A debi ba ube wu. Na ube jine nyamienim e bua kunta. Afa mra o peniswo. Eni de wa am peniswo no ehun. Nese ukutia nyanko po mra ube nu hun sa uyesa. The day that God brings the proceedings of the earth to an end. You will see how stupid you have been to disregard God's word. A day in Yankupon, the Via Sinia Mane Mu, a Kukuria Sien in our baby, you know. A honour of Behuse, say a Jimmy Sempa, say, Ubertum Yankupon Bra ago. You realize that all your national laws will come to nothing because it's God's law. That will be used to judge you whether you are a lawmaker, a politician, or a president. The same word you disregard today will be used to judge you. Ube hun se, ma mana ma mumra ni nina faso biya niso. Isan se, e ye nyanku pan sem, e na ye di bebu maten. Se, o ye oman yonio. Se uye embrache nyeu. Se uye omampe nyeu. Ase mkronwa. Wapuno neno. E nuana yadibebu ateng. So if you don't respect God's laws. 
you are digging your own grave. You want to burn forever in the hellfire. And this old moot Yanku Pomra, one Casa Utu Amina Ubeshia Fibo, oh Janua Enumdanum. On this Resurrection Sunday, I want open minded Christians to see that these are the perverse things that demons push people to do. One who saw the Ecosia day, the Pesce Christopher Majumu Daupa and who said, we ni a huhu ni ema Adamo ni pienpia nipa Ema omoye It is in this time That demons induce weak people To do abominable things Eye samri mwa Ene ya Adamo ni kika kika nipa Oye mreso Mawa ye e busu ni ema What demons are constantly doing to people is that They push people to do abominable things. They de bia da money edi ye nipa ni se. O pie pie nipa. Ama omu ye e busudye. What God says people should not do. Because it's an abomination. Because it's unthinkable. It's what demons want people to do. De nyan kupon kan se. Me nipa nye. E san se ye busudye. Demons want to use human beings to provoke God so that God will destroy them. Eh? Adamoni pese ofe ni pa da se ni so edi she nyanko po an bufo. Se de be a nyanko po an be se wong. And that was what they did to Judas during this time in history. Na sano omdi ye Judas Ewa sambre imu Ewa bako se imu Demons succeeded In pushing Judas To do the abominable thing Adamo ni Eye ya Etimi pie pie Judas Ema niko ye e busudie The Lord Jesus is holy And there is no iota of fault in him But Judas betrayed him to his enemies to be brutally crucified as if he was a sinner. Hey! It was serious, oh. A radi Jesus Christo ya krum krum. Nam from so kiti 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 kura nenemo. Nam so so Judas yi ni ma na tamfo. Ema obo na senu ya mu wo ati mo din so pa so. Ema ni kame ya tise de na oye di boye ni. That was the unthinkable thing that Judas did by betraying the Holy Lord. Judas Prior to that, the Lord Jesus warned Judas and all the apostles in Matthew chapter 26, verse 24, that the Son of Man indeed goes. Just as it is written of him. But woe to that man by whom the Son of Man is betrayed. It would have been good for that man if he had not been born. Hey! It was a serious warning, you know. Very serious. Hey! Judas heard that serious warning and even asked whether he was the one. Yet he continued to do the abomination by betraying the Holy Lord. Hey, that is what I'm talking about. Nan sana no, ne radia bo Judas eni asuma foring ina koko. Oh Matthew as empathy ediono nsiyan chiche mu ediono na ise. O ni pa bano di o kose di ya chro afano. Ne mum ni pa obe yino amano di onu ye ne se sa ni pa no ya ngono kra angaye. Hey, ne koko ba na nu edin pa o. Judas city is a cocoa na no ye ding na e ma mpo obisa se na e ye ono ana na so so ogusu a e ye ebusu de no wa bro yi ewrade kronkron e ma ye na no one sam na make demons push weak people who don't reason well 
to do abominable things. Adam only pian pian nipa one mra one jen ye and my way a busunema. When such people are under the influence of demons, the only thing that comes on their mind is do it, do it, do it. Yes, it's only doing and not thinking about the repercussions of the actions. Sesa nipano ebe she adamon in sheso asia. Adi ebe omo jini moa ye koye koye koye. Sesa koye mkoa ne monsun sasoni de omo jini mukra. Judas betrayed the Holy Lord without thinking about the consequences of his actions. Judas ye a radi kronko ne mai wa bra wangi. But right after betraying the Holy Lord, Judas realized that he had done an abomination. So he went to hang himself. Then so so, wabro ye a rade krum krum ma ye no pe, and a Judas a hun se hey, ma ye busu di pa, and a okose na hun. When something is an abomination in God's sight, it's not even thought about. Let alone do it. One more say, "A dear be a busudia wo nyami niswa ye nyene humpo nankampe se why?" It means such a thing goes against his ordinance, and it infuriates him to punish the one who does that heavily. Asiyeti le se sadi eno ekuti ane mbra ene ne shisha ye na emane bufu pa na ochini pa oye sadi ena son e wakanya anu ye te pa aso. Let me end here. God willing, next week I will continue. Mami fancy ya ne nyami ya dumu adase ne me ba betu aso. If you are wise, never think of doing anything that God says human beings should never do. Because you will attract God's heavy punishment in Jesus' name. Amen. So we are here. We are here. So we are here. 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 Amen. On this Resurrection Sunday, if you are wise, give your life to the Lord Jesus Christ because it is He who created you and will use His word to judge you. As you pray this prayer with me. So we are here. Jesus Christ. It sounds like you're not a bow. Now, I didn't say I'm so a baby. What I brought me boss and pay. Lord Jesus, I thank you for speaking to me today. I accept that I am a sinner. But from this day forward, I believe in my heart and confess with my mouth that. Jesus, you are the only Lord. Forgive me of all my sins. And write my name in the book of life. Let your Holy Spirit dwell in me. And I will live a holy life to please you. Thank you for saving me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Father, thank you for speaking to your creation for them to know that it is you who created this world and it is your laws that should be feared the most. It is your word that will be used to judge everyone yes. so that they will serve you with fear and trembling in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Daniel means papa, 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 papa.
se ewie mremu nyame asem kroji e na wokoye ni moka e chie nipa nim se obi bia ra otie obi a be ye nyansani na wodi nyame asem e betoto abrabo ene ni ekoso ewie mremu wahu na wafa nyansa sua semu odofo a wutie ye ene anopai a e Reverend Dr. Kukudazi Ephraim, and I would say, Ninka, AP Radio 105.7. A beer now per se will say, Tia, a semi beumwa, Ukuada, and if yada, and you mean on song, a semi ever sign, a timu beum, a way P radio haya. Na who share a chill up quine, now per se or near the summer. Ye were holy land, a a walk Kasi me road ube hunse abatwa anase mayanka ewo wunsa benkumsua. Ni fa sono yewo feeling stations mienu etu atu asu woho. Die di kain ye tosu mienu e kwain da ni nchemu ewo wunsa ni fa so e sane kofom. Fa sa kwain na e da wunsa ni fa so sane kofom no suwa. Uko si fomu chaya enko bebi ebi yuma e hua eni holy land. And no question, ye oh, sorry, a das runko. Ah, ye ye, radia ye. So, we are sorry, a my ye, no, a dim could name a woo, and near some ado so. A some ado, you woo suffer a crud. Now, so we a Christo de ma pa, and ne, who be jay de we ye, na now walk quite sorry, a quee a radi, aye, and ne, papa can some ama. My genu, a chim, a bissy baby, say. Em, one more, she shamra, Emma, if we are see, we are see, and I am my man move for no. One more come here, yes, say, or moon moon, the yen yammy. Then yammy be any ho, no moon, your mo canoe, and I a yam fa. Nana me be some who say. Ah, now one more now, my man, for one more better, one more president, one more lawmakers, me had no, one more would that now, one more that's what it is. Say, say, one more, I mean, yammy, no, think it is so move. Now say, yammy, be woha, one more to me, woo, I want to be so poor, move one. No, my crack was she, no, be what, and yeah, and yeah, and then you fool, and yeah, a man more fool, the politicians, we shall ye ba. Es ebe ka se ye ye bibifo ni egusu wo nko aso mu ebe ya kakra no de eburo ni be di no obehye ye se ye ni na ye ensem hunu pa se wo wuti nkrom na wo xa wo mra na pese wo de behye ye ko na emra nya mi ahyehye e wo nya mi asem nyina eno a na mo mu di ahyehye se ye fa mu mu man na mo me kodru ba bia Mose we dia ye mpe no ye be fa ya kwan so ah bra e won hye so de e wo ho e wo sodom ni gomora ah wo betimi e hunu se ade we ya ye ye de de di hye nyame abufu enu nti e wo se ye hwe yi ye no sikenti ya ba fom e ye asema a reho ah mi bi sa be se Sika hiya na mampeni fuo ni amanyo fuo mo hiya. Mo pe sika no amo di kwa hene. Na sika ni se na mwenya na se na haka. Mwure fise bin mwe uwe je sika no. A wantu atu aswa no. Omu be mwomu tirisu wa. Na demo omu be mwomu tirisu. Demo a hel so ye bomo. Ye uko jine nyamye numa. Wa kache na me se. Na me kaya se wini ho. Enne, enne, e kwa jida. Ya papa kani yina. Suya nyansa, e fri nyami ya semimu. Na jun hui ye, ne nyami, obe bisaw. Posishi mbiya, nyami di ama wo sabri, e wo hose, ubu hon atentene en. Na se, wadwe jina biye bi, ne wa anye di nyami ka, na wo chia nwa, obe kwa kubu hon ate. Da nyami shira wa papa, papa, papa. Sama would ya be a who judicem, a who proposed so. Amen. Amen, Mamma. Onia, ya mean some day and to tuna see what it. Upa to chinny. We had there some crudo and no honey, ya may be boating. 
My dear, you can't downplay God's word. Whether you like it or not, it is the same word that will be used to judge you. You can decide to do away with the word today, but it's the same word that will be used to judge you. So on this Resurrection Sunday, be warned if you are living an apathetic life against God's word. Give your life to the Lord Jesus Christ and live according to his word. If you don't want to burn forever in the hellfire, come to church and be trained properly. And I'm telling you that as you give your life to my Lord Jesus Christ, no demon can do anything to you. It is my God who has all the power. That is why I always tell you that with God, all things are possible. God bless you. Go to church and celebrate the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Amen.